Hello friends, this is Priyanka. Today we are going to solve a problem on wind energy for the calculation of tip speed ratio. So first I will read what is the given problem. If you have a wind turbine with three blades each 4 meter long, what distance does the tip of each blade travel in one full revolution? If this turbine is rotating at a rate of 42 revolution per minute, how long does it take for one full revolution? What is the speed of wind turbine? If the wind is blowing at 6 meter per second, what is the tip speed ratio of this turbine? And it is too slow or too fast for the maximum power. So this was the given question. So let us first understand what is the given data and which factors we have to find out. So if we observe the number of blades that is equal to 3 is given and the length of the blade is also given. So this length of the blade is 4 meter and if we observe for this length of blade it will act as the radius for that circular area. So we can say that length of blade that is L which is equal to radius of the circle which is equal to R which is equal to 4 meter. And we have to find out what is the distance traveled by blade in one revolution that we have to find out. Then the blade turbine rotating rate. So the blade turbine rotating rate is given 42 rpm that is 42 revolution per minute. So here in one minute how many revolutions are getting completed that is 42 revolutions are getting completed. And we have to find out what is the time for one full revolution of the blade how long means what what is the time that is required for one complete revolution of the blade we have to also find out what is the speed of the wind turbine and then the wind velocity is given 6 meters per second and we have to find out what is the tip speed ratio that is TSR and with this calculated TSR for the maximum power this tip speed ratio is too slow or too fast that also we have to find out so let us move for the calculations now we will move for the first question that is the what is the distance traveled by blade tip in one revolution so what is the distance that is traveled by blade tip in one revolution that means we have to find out what is the circumference of that circle so what is the circumference of circle that is equal to 2 pi r and r is equal to this length of the blade. So we will put here 2 pi into 4 that is equal to 25 meter. So this is the distance traveled by the blade tip in one complete revolution. Now the next question is time for one full revolution of the blade. So for the one revolution of the blade we have to find out the time and if we observe the blade turbine rotating rate 42 revolution in one minute is given that means in one minute there are total 60 seconds so here we will convert this in 60 seconds there are 42 revolutions and what is the time for the one revolution so we will write here here is the time and here is the number of revolution so for 60 second 42 revolution and for the one revolution what is the time that is here is the question mark so we will make here the cross multiplication and we will consider here this as a x unknown factor that is x so x into 42 which is equal to 60 into 1 therefore x is equal to 60 by 42 and which is equal to 1.43 second so this is the time required for one complete revolution then the next speed of the wind turbine so speed of the wind turbine how to find out so for that we have to find out what is the distance traveled by the blade tip so what is the distance traveled by the blade tip that is circumference of the circle or simply we can say that speed of the wind turbine means what it is in the meter per second that is this we have to find out what is the distance traveled in meter and what is the time that is required to com complete that distance so now we have calculated what is the distance for one complete revolution 
so it is 25 meter and what is the time for the complete one revolution so for the one revolution the time is 1.43 second so here meter per second that is 25 by 1.43 which is equal to 17 meter per second is the speed of the wind turbine now we will move for the next now here the wind velocity is given that is 6 meter per second and we have to find out what is the tip speed ratio so tip speed ratio the notation is lambda and what is the formula that is the tip speed of the blade divided by wind speed so what is the tip speed of the blade so tip speed of the blade or the we can say speed of wind turbine is 17 meter per second and what is the wind speed uh, that is wind velocity is given 6 so lambda is equal to 17 by 6 which is equal to 2.8 now here this is the ratio so there is no any unit now this calculated tip speed ratio we have to find out it is too slow or too fast for the maximum power so how to find out the tip speed ratio for the maximum power so we can say that lambda optimal that is for the maximum power instead of lambda we will use here the lambda optimal and which is equal to 4 pi by n now what is this n n is the number of blades and here that is given 3 so we will put here 4 pi by 3 that is equal to 4.2 now we have to compare this 2.8 and 4.2 so this is the tip speed ratio for the maximum power but in actual it is 2.8 so we can say that this 2.8 is very less than this 4.2 that means this tip speed ratio is too slow for the maximum power so we can write here it is too slow and this is the answer